Why are you being like this? Look, man, I know that this is hard, but- I thought that we were cool, man. Are you doing this just because you're scared of her, or are you just trying to push me and Minnie apart? No, that's not what I'm trying to do at all. I'm just trying to tell you there are some things you don't know about your sister. I thought you and I had an understanding. Minnie may have some issues every now and then, but the Minnie I know would never hurt a fly. Why do you keep badmouthing her like she's some kind of poster child for the apocalypse? Because she is not what you and everyone else think she is. Deep down, Minnie has the capability to commit the unspeakable. Do I look stupid? Even if what you said was true, I would have known that when she gave me her eye. It showed me everything about her when... When she died! Her life, her memories, her secrets, her powers, and especially you. I know everything about her. No, not everything. What? There is something dark, so deep even that douchebag angel warrior dude couldn't see when he came to claim her soul. She's just like her mom. Junior, beneath whatever smile she has or look in her eye, there is a thing that makes demons terrible at the mere presence of it. This is her true nature, and she has hipped it from you all her life, but I can feel she's slowly succumbing to it. Minnie is just as ruthless and linically evil. Don't you lecture me about evil. If I recall, didn't you try to devour every living soul in Halloween Town, Uncle Jack, Aunt Sally? You tried to kill everyone, and Minnie stopped you. You're right. I was a monster. Or worse yet, I could have been a god. But now, here I am, helping you babysit little Miss Angel Face. And you know what? I'm fine with it. In fact, I'm kind of happy about taking care of Mimi. You know why? 